the zygote is diploid since it contains two sets of chromosomes. Human beings have 46 chromosomes, out of which 44 are autosomes, and the remaining two are sex chromosomes. The human male contains 44 autosomes plus one X and one Y chromosome. So, 50% of the gametes formed by the male will have X and 50% will have Y chromosomes. The human female contains 44 autosomes plus 2 X chromosomes. So, all gametes formed by the female will have X chromosomes. The sex of the baby depends on the sperm that fertilizes the ovum. The ovum contains one X chromosome and 22 autosomes. If the sperm that fertilizes the ovum carries an X chromosome, then the zygote will have two X chromosomes and the embryo will develop into a female offspring. But if the sperm that fertilizes the ovum carries a Y chromosome, then the zygote will have one X and one Y chromosome and the embryo will develop into a male offspring. After fertilization, the zygote moves down towards the uterus, all the while undergoing a series of mitotic divisions. This series of cell divisions by which a single fertilized egg cell is transformed into a multicellular blastula is called cleavage. The cells formed by cleavage are called the blastomere. Cleavage transforms the single-celled zygote into the many-celled blastula then the 16-celled morula, and finally the hollow blastocyst. The blastocyst contains an outer layer of blastomeres called the trophoblast layer and an inner mass of blastomeres attached to the trophoblast. The inner blastomeres together constitute the inner cell mass.